I could speak for 42 years tonight about my life here, but this is it. I want you to see, not hear. Art is about words. It's not about words. It's about vision and seeing. Okay. So I will end by sharing two more pieces of information. One, the title. One of Tom's many, coming from one of Tom's many quotes. Hang on here. Okay, it's in Latin. So you listen carefully now. This is the correct pronunciation because I will butcher it. Sapere aude. Sapere aude. Okay. It's a Latin phrase originally used by Horace uh, in his first book of epistles. The translated sentence from which it came is, He who has begun is half done. Dare to know. Which can also be translated as dare to be wise. So, sapere aude. Dare to know. Dare to be wise. The second most important quote for me is from my favorite book, one of the only books I've read because I don't read, I'm an artist. It was a first kindergarten book, the Dick and Jane McGuffey Reader. Okay. Now, some of you know that, book, so you're old. Simple quote I remember from that is, look and see. So for me, let us look and see. changing. No time of the day will it be the same. When you walk by it, there's constant patterns changing, and it's lit at night. All the lighting is within the base, so at night it's a glowing beacon. So you have to come by and see it at night, even if you don't want to. <laughs> now, that also in the daytime, when the sun, in the morning we were here, and the sun comes through the back and lights the piece up from the back. So you can now begin to see JD ever gets it off. No, I, no, I got my special implement. He's got it. He's got it. Okay, he's got it. There you go. So movement is an integral part of your viewing of the piece. If you go up there and see it from on top, there's a, a, a polished mirrored finish on, on the platform, and you'll see the piece reflected back and down. Okay? So uh, that's it. It speaks for itself. Yeah.